could be really looking at the map, which could help. But oh, that was nice. I'm gonna let up. What's up, everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We are here on Forza Horizon 4 on the mainlands to do something today, if you haven't guessed by the title. Some of the hardest off-road rally stages I've done in Horizon 4 yet. We are on our G920, full 900 degrees of rotation. That active wing on this uh, car is pretty sweet. So if you guys have been following, you guys know that you guys can unlock the Ken Block racing uniform. I've already completed this on expert to get my Kemp Lock racing suit and hat but I wasn't recording at the time and I did not think about it but these were some of the most intense roads I've ever driven on so we're gonna do it again today with the wheel Logitech G920 still couldn't memorize these tracks you know what's better than a seasonal championship in the summer no what's uh, that not much really yeah Have you're right fun. so we're gonna do it again we are on our G920 full 900 degrees of rotation hydraulic handbrake H pattern shifter, gas brake clutch underneath. We are going to be doing this, as you can see, rocking the full Ken Block uniform. So, I've done a lot of off road, uh, off road races and stuff in Horizon, and I've done a lot on a wheel. Um, the force feedback update was supposed to help how the wheel feels. I feel like it has a little bit. It feels a little bit better. Um, it's not perfect, but it feels a little bit better. The car's a little bit more controllable, so we're gonna do that today. But like I said, these are some of the hardest off-road uh, stages I've done so far in Horizon 4. So we're gonna have a little fun with this. We're just gonna hop right into it and uh, go for the gusto. We are still... I totally forgot about this turn. They are still on expert mode. And the gear ratios are so short on these uh, focuses. So I feel like this first race, if you guys haven't completed this, in order to get your guys' uh, Ken Block uniforms, you might guys want to get on this. Because uh, it's pretty sweet. It is kind of challenging. And this first one is not as bad as the second one, which is a lot longer. And it's a point to point. But like I said, these are some of the toughest rally stages I've done in this game so far. Ooh, don't want to lose that. And you can see the the uh, feel of the wheel because I'm still on my normal uh, settings that I've shown you in other videos. The wheel does feel pretty good. It's not super uh, uncontrollable. I can still get good control, still catch the slide. The car doesn't really slide too much out of my hands anymore. So I feel like the update has changed a little bit of how it feels. Except for when we totally mess up that turn. So, oh, if you guys haven't tried these uh, stages yet, make sure you guys give this a shot. This is uh, definitely not an easy feat on a wheel. I can see it being a little bit easier on a controller, but uh, you know, we're a uh, full 900 degrees of rotation here on this channel. Never change. Sometimes I run 870, but that's just for a little buffer, but normally, oh boy, we are on full 900 degrees. And really high force feedback. We have not broken our G920 yet, so that's something to be said. I was about to rip the handbrake, but decided not decided better of that we're gonna slide a little counter steer catch the car going to fifth this car definitely likes fifth gear and you can pretty much stay in fifth through most of this section just trying to play it cool oh don't try not to lose miss checkpoints not gonna lie the first time I did this I did miss some checkpoints and I still don't know the route. It's really hard to memorize this route. Don't miss that. Thank you. I'm going to try to do this without missing checkpoints. 
hole. Kind of makes me want to get back into uh, some dirt rally, dirt four, and uh, dirt rally. Please tell me I got that. Dirt Rally 2.0 coming out end of this month. Definitely super excited for that. We'll be getting Dirt Rally 2.0, so there will be Dirt Rally 2.0 content here on the channel coming when it comes out on the 28th, I believe is the uh, release date. So just so you know, there will be Dirt Rally 2.0 here on the channel. I'm going to miss it. Oh, totally off. Way off track. Somewhat back on track. This is challenging. If you guys are on a wheel, I challenge you to go 900 degrees and do this, because this is... Oh, boy. This is not an easy feat. I think we'll take second. Oh! Well, we would take second if I didn't misshift my gears well. Wait, how did we take third? So confused. I thought we were in second. Uh, Forza? Apparently there was somebody else up there. All right, well, the aspect of today is just complete these challenges in this uh, very difficult environment. So we're gonna fast travel to the next one to do uh, the next race here and, uh, well, this one, I believe, is probably the longest and hardest one I've done yet. It's a lot of fun. There's a lot of tight sections. There's a lot of very tight turns and stuff like that. So, like I said, if you guys haven't gotten your Ken Block racing suit and uh, Monster Energy Drink hat, you guys should probably get on this. Um, if you're on a wheel, give it a shot. Let me know if you've done it on a wheel. Come, let me know it on the comment section down below because I'd be very interested to see what other people's takes on uh, this uh, rally route is because it's pretty demanding. It's uh, almost like a dirt, dirt four or dirt rally stage, but uh, here on Horizon with other cars. So you got that aspect in the mix as well as the Horizon four dirt car not handling as well as it should. But I do feel the feedback has uh, the feedback update they did does make it feel a little bit better. It's not perfect by any means, but it's better. It does feel good. One thing I don't like is how long it takes Horizon to load. All right, let's go. Let's see if they fix the clutch issue. Oh, I don't have to be on the clutch in the beginning, so the car doesn't stall out. Like if you're not on the clutch for the manual. Car stalls out in the beginning, even though you're revving full RPMs. Well, that's a good fix to know. I didn't know they fixed that. Well, good thing we uh, tested that out. Oh boy, get a little bit slippery on this mud or dirt. Do feel a little bit of the uh, loss of control for Horizon 4 and dirt on the G920. Oh man, I forgot about this turn. Let's settle the car down. Oh, and this is why I said it is one of the, oh, oh boy. One of the harder, hardest rally sections I've done in Horizon 4 to date. And I think this is a community designed one. So kudos to whoever designed this. Wow, totally forgot about that. I should be looking at the map so I know where I'm going, but I'm trying to just focus on not losing control of the car. I swear I'm better, because I got my Ken Blocky to play, but... Here we go. Oh, don't die, don't die, don't die. So it's super sketchy. Super sketchy! Trees, rocks, cliff. Trying not to die, because this is very tough on a wheel. Oh, tree. Oh, die. Oh, that bump was not a good thing. What happened up here? Where, why are these guys all stopped? Oh. Don't I? Oh, as I say that, we go head first into a tree. Do 
Excuse me. Coming through. This is not easy. I know I keep saying this, but uh, give it a shot yourselves if you have a wheel. Oh my lord. Down here. Oh, so many sharp turns. So many tight hairpins, and we're only 50% done. This is so. And there's that. Uh, there's that Forza dirt oscillation that gets every Forza user. Ah, oh, get fracked. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, we uh, we managed to fail that with a missed checkpoint. But uh, just goes to show that you know, well, this is not easy, but it's. Doable. Some of the toughest roads. We don't need that brick wall. Some of the toughest roads I feel ever put together in a race. This car is all over the place on me right now. Oh yeah, I forgot about that bridge. I keep forgetting about this. I ran this once and I'm sitting here like I should know this track, but... There's no way to know this entire thing unless you did this a few more times. Could be really looking at the map, which could help. But, oh, that was nice. There we go. Don't die. Don't die. And we're still only 70% done. This is demanding. I feel like the only time I've ever really been this demanding in an off-road race is in a rally game. But this is by far the hardest and roughest off-road race section I've done. That was a nice turn. Here on Horizon 4. I can see the finish. It is up here. Wheel chattering. G920 shaking. Almost coming apart. Take uh oh my Lanta. So <laughs> we managed to survive with only one missed checkpoint. Definitely not an easy feat. We're <laughs> Unable to win this one. We won it once before, but we've already completed this. So if you guys like these types of videos, let me know in the comment section down below. Ah, don't care. Already got it. So as always, make sure you guys follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll have a in the description box below. As always, I like to thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the next one.